Right, Canyon Speed Ray now. Very simple stuff, I mean, simple compared to my last attempt at uh, IC Speed Ray, that was terrible. Right, start with some muses, simple stuff. Nothing too complex. You know the drill by now. Get rid of the tractors as well. Little cheeky peek there. Onto the rings, classic favourite. I don't know why, but I caught, I saw, I caught a light. But I saw like a session, like going down this um, tunnel to get the rings. Charge after the tractors. No idea what's riding them. Can't really see. If you can figure it out, please let me know. They're like giant squirrels. That's what I've got to come to mind anyway. Don't know why. And there we go. Let's go get these vultures now, whatever they are. Yeah, I think they're vultures. Ugly birds, whatever they are. Massive eyes, that's like, what the hell? We're going around in circles. This is pointless. One last one. B E A, beautiful. Let's see what I got there then. Wow, that's not bad at all. 59 seconds, less than a minute. I think it's like 1 minute 9 yet to get to uh, get this skill point. Nothing too tricky. Do -do -do. I think you can get like, around here, you can actually um, get over it if you're incredibly skillful like me who can't even get that high. I don't know why I'm doing this. <laughs> it's nice to glide around a bit actually. Anyway, now I'm going to do Hunter's Challenge. Alright, Spyro. Are you ready to try out my plane? I just Suppose so. It, and I'm pretty sure it won't crash now. Yeah, because who was flying it last time? Oh yes, Hunter. Okay, Spyro. Here's what you've got to do. I've got the plane on remote control. So all you have to do is hit the targets with your machine gun. Press circle to fire the gun and... Yes, we know, Hunter. We can fly planes. Isn't that hard? Right, so this is um, quite an easy task, really. Nice and simple. Hunter's got control of the plane. You're just shooting around. My my advice, just fly like hell. Go for it. Who cares about accuracy? It's about having fun. <laughs> quite funny how Spyro sits comfortably in that plane perfectly. Although it doesn't look that comfortable. Not really. Anywho, it's very easy. Got some blimps to a... Uh, Add some variety. And of course they move as well to make it more difficult. It's a fairly easy task though. Although at some points though, there are some targets that you see and you used to think, oh, I'll go for those. But you, it's best to leave those to later because then you come round them again. Like now that one there. Don't go for it yet. Go for one over here. You then turn around. That's twenty third. Two more left. Bang in. Hey, you nailed all of the targets. It must be because you had such a good pilot. Or because I was actually quite a good shot. TBH. 49 orbs. Not bad. Yep. No, I'll go above a sake around. Let's get back now. What level should we do first? Oh, Mystic Marsh sounds good to me. First one, of course, so must do it in order. Mystic Marsh, then. It's a. What's. I think I like about Mystic March is. I was going to say it before. Mystic March. Mystic Marsh. It's um, non linear. You haven't got to follow a certain course. Especially if you use your um, double jump. Actually, I'm about to get this quickly. Massive big one for Norb in it. Pretty snazzy. Actually, no, no, no. Let's. Let's, um, let's, let's finish exploring um, Mr. Tundra first. I mean, you might as well. We'll start exploring it. Be ashamed to leave it. Gems mainly. And of course, there's the famous swimming glitch that Jim and I Dazzy made famous, and I'm gonna attempt that as well. This was all I have a go at it. Oh, I press this here, and then I miss portals. No, no. I can see you've learned the value of orb spiral. This touchy gate should work perfectly with the help of your impressive orb collection. I think it's 25 you need. But Metropolis is a brilliant level, futuristic. Um, yeah, it's good. I like it. Robots that speak in weird voices like this that have no sort of emotion in them. <laughs> and the awful stairs that are a pain to get up. 
made easy by the double jump of course and there's a lure waiting for you when you've uh, got all the orbs that you can run in and do the work as usual so you stand out there watching Uh, this is where the glitch is. Let me give it a try. Do, do, do. Let's get into this mountain bit here. No! You're very annoying. Might as well do this actually. Come down here by the waterfall. A little underwater bit. Very nice. Head down this little tunnel bit. And. Just make sure something here. <laughs> nope. And you go down this tunnel. And you keep going. And. Up you go to the water, and there's the orb! Oh, that made me smile when I first discovered that. <laughs> Nothing like those little secret things that you just... Ma it makes it a hundred times better when you actually find out how to get to it. Mystic Marsh, no gems around here. Right, so this is well in this time. This takes you right up to the top of um, the old... Uh, the tower. I am sorry for sound legs. I'm trying to get sorted out. It is lagging a bit. Oh no. Oh, well, I think it's just lost this file because. Imagine Clank's working fine. I don't understand it. Um. Boo, doo, doo, doo. No, I can't get from here. This is gonna try, I'm gonna try anyway though. Oh no, this is failing! No, Massive fool. Life down then. Oh, it's off a shot. Oh, we're down here! Anger! <laughs> Come on, let's try to get us done before the next part, at least. Please. I have to get really close and just get the jump perfect. Come on, come on, get the hover right. Oh yes, we're in. Now you just have to go around here to the top of the waterfall. So there's one glitch getting on the waterfall. Actually, I haven't, I haven't done the main glitches recently. Actually, I sort of stopped doing them. Sorry. Anyway, you go glide around here. Do do do. Head down here to where the river is. When we get to a certain point, like now, swim, and there we go! B E A, you difficult. Got the first time round, it's even better. You need to swim around here for a little bit. Swim out to the moon if you want to. You can go on forever and ever, and you just look around, and suddenly you're miles out like that. It's quite good. What the hell? That's never happened before! Okay, so Daddy found the swimming glitch, but I just found that. You swim out to a certain point over there, and boom, you just fall down. That is. Amazing! That blew my mind, as you can tell. Um, anything else I need? No. So I'm not gonna bother doing the rest of the glitch. You see it now. On Mystic March, Marsh, 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 Marsh. Um, it's a good level, as I said before, with wizards apparently. Not the sort of Harry Potter wizards though. But it's like ah, water. Weird snail elephant things. <laughs> and it stops and they're like, oh no! <laughs> Weird sounds, they fall down. Oh my god. Now anyone who's seen Potter, 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 Potter Puppet Pals, if you've seen one in that, that's what it's that's what it reminds me of. <laughs> just aren't the same since our magic fountain shut off. Oh it no. It would help if you could find out what evil force is behind this disaster. Yeah, I suppose so. It's kind of funny how they have low voices there, deep manly voices, and yet in that video they're just like, Woo! and doing really silly things like I just sound like there. Yeah, and quite silly as well. We spend all day just sitting around a fountain, going ah, fountain. Seriously, if I do that all day, I'd never get anything done. It's Twenty. Quite a few. So yeah, you can just go anywhere. It's nice, I like it. It's freedom! 
Oh my god, I just got pwned by a snail elephant. <laughs> Being the news tomorrow. Oh, he gets pwned by a snail elephant. Oh dear. So you can get up here with the um, old double jump. You can head around to where um, the big jump allows you to uh, go. Big jump, that sounds technical. The super jump. Uh, that's the thing though, when it's non linear, it's sort of like, where do I go now? <laughs> oh well, that's what I like it. 